Welcome to beautiful, sunny Southern California. Now, a lot of cars are going to the rear for changes and adjustments. Uh, they found a problem in the ignition system on Kyle Larson's car. I was worried when we had to start in the back just because I didn't know how these cars would handle in dirty air. I thought they would be really, really bad in dirty air and, and be really tight, but we were able to cruise to the front. The five car Kyle Larson coming on strong. That was encouraging because I thought it was going to be really hard to get up there. I think he was really smart about uh, picking and choosing where to make his passes, knew how to bide his time, save his tires a little bit, because there was a lot of cars slipping and sliding right away. You know, it's almost like Darlington of old. You run 10 or 15 laps, tires get worn out, somebody blows the tire, hits the fence. California's own Tyler Reddick will get his fifth career stage win. Unless he had issues, I did not think anybody had uh, a chance to beat him today. Midway through the second stage, I was finally able to stay with William and Reddick. So once you know, that kind of happened, I was like, okay, we just need to try and maintain this balance. I thought if we made the right adjustments, we could run with him. And, and knowing how, how good Kyle is at this place, and of course in general, that we, we would have a shot to run with him. I don't know that we could have beat him. Trouble for our leader here as he drops oh, back he just got hit. He hits the wall, guys. And William Byron is involved. Well, it definitely went from bad to worse right there for Tyler Reddick. Anybody's ready to win now. Might as well be us. Yes, sir. I think probably all of us got excited at that point because we all felt like we had a, a better shot at winning. Outside, outside, outside. Look at this. Whoa. Hang on. Stupid. <laughs> Damn it, I'm sorry. I didn't know he was there. Obviously, I never would want to do that. I was just so focused on looking out of my left side at Joey and trying to time the side drafts right because it's such a long straightaway. I forgot to even look in my mirror. My spotter, I think he probably must have thought Chase was going to stay with me, so I didn't even know how close he was to me. And when I peeled, he was screaming outside at me, and by that point, it was it was too late. I wasn't even close. I mean, I'm like way, way outside. I was worried about a little retaliation. You never want to be that guy, especially with a teammate. So take as much as I can take. Definitely showed his displeasure right there, and rightfully so. I hate that I ended a great recovery run that they had, and you know, they worked hard to come back from, I think, two laps down to have a legitimate shot at winning the race. The little swerve from Chase was obviously him expressing his displeasure, which is fine. I, I, I get it, because that was potentially the race-winning move for Chase. And at that point, we kind of had to, okay, turn that page and we still got 20 laps left. We just had to, to buckle back in and keep going. Just the way it is. This is the finish that this packed grandstand came to see, and nobody is sitting down. The last restart was wild. I got a good push from behind. Honestly, probably too good for what I for what I wanted. Down to the bottom goes Logano. Suarez got a good good exit of two and was able to side draft me and get by. I was praying that he was going to go to the bottom, and he did. Big run for Larson in the draft. Drop it to the bottom and at the line. Larson by a car length. But was able to uh, just have enough grip and a good enough balance to hold him off. For the checkered flag, Kyle Larson keeps that surfboard trophy in California. Feels good. That took a lot of hard work. Very thankful that we're locked in the playoffs. But we still have 30, what, four races left this season. We, we got to keep our, our laser focus ahead of us. You know, learn the new car, know how to execute a race, get better every week. You know, all the very fundamental things. Glad that we were the ones able to do it. And uh, just really proud of my team for the hard work that they put in to get better. Hey, race fans. Thanks for watching our video. For all NASCAR on Fox News content and the best clips from Fox Sports, be sure to follow and subscribe to our channel.